Yo, what's going on, guys? It's your boy Kimbo here, and it's uh, Kizzle's birthday today. I don't know if it's going to be the same day I put this out, but, like, the, the day I'm making it, yeah. Yeah! 17! 17, man. But, yeah, anyways, we have a special Beyblade video here, so... Uh, I, have to, I, have to, I have to say something. I have to say something. What? Uh, everyone, we can pick up my latest skit. Uh, okay, this is his birthday best. It's pretty great. <laughs> it's pretty nice, pretty good. But, yeah, like, it's it's his birthday. Go sub to him. Like, show him some love. Everyone, everyone go subscribe to the channel thing. Oh my gosh. All right. But anyways, I, I got to get in this video. I don't want people to think I'm stalling. All right. So we have an epic. It's kind of a mod and it's like an accidental mod too. So like I was sitting here and I was just testing out like a combo. Uh, uh, speaking of which, this is going to be this is going to be a future combo, by the way. You know, I know some people are going to be like, oh, dang. Well, crap. It's going to go on a team. But yeah, anyways, the bay that I have here, um, I'm going to show you what this mod is, obviously. But the bay I have that shows this mod is this right here so it is grand uh valkyrie so yeah grand valkyrie because it's got the valkyrie uh getinko chip on it and then it's got the layer weight and such but yeah so this is a little bit of a mod as you can tell already it's a pretty simple mod i'm gonna make this video as short as i can because like it's a small little mod but i think it's really really cool um and i didn't realize it so it literally makes it uh like uh, i'll say what the mod is obviously for those who don't understand yet um you can look at the layer itself and you notice something the hexes aren't pointing upwards, they're pointing down. So, like, it's weird, because you can actually put the Gatinko chip on upside down. I did it on accident, but yeah, it just shines through right there. Um, yeah, as you can see, and it fills in, like, a little bit of that gap right there. So, in turn, what it does is it makes it so a Takara Tomy Beyblade is like a Hasbro Beyblade, where it has slopes instead of the teeth. Believe it or not, it's actually really, really cool. Like, I figured it out on accident. I was like, what the heck? Like, the, the Valkyrie has two huge freaking teeth. Like, it should not be doing this. But, yeah, um, it, it does that. So, um, as you see right there, like, look at this. See, it slides over just like slopes, and it comes off. Like, if you try this out, like, you know, be careful with it because you don't want to wear down your parts big time or anything. But, yeah, so literally just how you do this mod, it's really, really simple. You literally just take the bay. Like, you know, if you have a GT bay, you need a GT bay in order to be able to do this, Um, you know, because of the, uh, the layer weight and such. But, yeah, so all you do is you take your bay apart, obviously with the three parts. So you obviously have, like, uh, the... The Tinko chip layer weight and then the bottom part of the layer. Um, the normal way that it is in there is that you just put it in, like, obviously the spots for the layer weight. Not that way, it's the other way. I'm just a dork. Uh, but, yeah, um, you just put it in normally. And then you put it on, but it, that's the normal way that you do it. So what you do is you literally just take it and you flip it upside down. You literally just flip it over upside down and then put it together together. And this is how you do this. Like I said, it might put a little bit of wear. But yeah, put it might put like a little bit of wear on your driver. So definitely just like do it with caution. But yeah, it's something that's just really, really cool. And I figured it out by accident. So because of that, you know, this metal point in there sticks right there. And it literally is just like slopes for uh, Hasbro Bay. And it's actually like, like you know, they're pretty tight slopes too like you know it's 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 really interesting but yeah that's how you can make like a takara tomi beyblade like a hasbro beyblade so yeah a cool little mod that i just figured out literally by accident like <laughs> i didn't realize i put it in upside down but yeah so you know you just flip it over the right way and it should act like your standard beyblade burst uh, gt bay so yeah let me just put this in place here there we go and it snaps in more you know and now you can see the hexes are up here you know, they are upright. You just snap those together, and then it'll return it to its regular teeth. So, yeah. And then you'll just hear the clicks. So, boom, boom. So, yeah, you know, just a cool little mod. Um, It might actually be, like, kind of tighter with the slopes. I might do a battle, like, testing it out. I don't know, man. But, yeah, maybe in a separate video. <laughs> but, yeah, anyways, just thought it was really, really cool. Um, Do it. All right, well, it's his birthday, so I'll do it. But, yeah, I'll let you guys know what this combo is. This is, uh, it's Grant. <laughs> but, yeah, what the bay is in total, it is Grand Valkyrie. So, obviously, Grand from Grand Dragon, Valkyrie from Slash Valkyrie. Um, and it's got Valkyrie's Gatinko chip in it, you know. Uh, not Retsu, it's the other one, I think. But, yeah, um... No, it is, I think it might be Retsu, or uh, nah, but yeah, you know. Anyways, I'll remember it after, somebody can tell me. But yeah, it's got one 
Uh, one star and fusion. So yeah, man, it's got the two clicks right now, but I will switch it over and just, actually I'll compare the two. So yeah, here we go, man. All right, guys, so it is battle time. Uh, yeah, we so the, for the battle, I'm just gonna use like obviously the grand uh, Valkyrie, you know, um, with one, yeah, one star fusion. And it's gonna take on Chosy Achilles. I have it face Chosy Achilles. This is a custom Chosy Achilles that I have that's actually gonna go on another team as well, Crimson Knights, just saying. But yeah, it's got one planet. So this should be a really interesting battle, and it'll definitely show it. So I'll probably just go to, like, two or three with each one, you know, just to show how it goes. But, yeah, it's a good opponent. It shows the Achilles doesn't burst, and it'll just show how strong this dragon is. But, yeah, man, here we go. Yo, okay, some big-time hits. It's in the regular mode right now, you know. So this is standard. Yo, big hits, though. Really huge hits. Uh-oh. Who's going to take it, man? Who's going to take it? Achilles or dragon? Oh, and Achilles takes that one. And it, it lost one click. So, yeah, that is one to zero. Um, yeah, and one of the wings came out uh, for Achilles. But, yeah, man, there we go. Got a big-time launch there. Yo, big hits. Huge hits, man. Oh, and it got sent out, man. So that's two. I'll do one more battle. You know, I might as well. Um, and then I'll switch it up. But, yeah, man, this... This Grand Valkyrie combo is doing decent. It's doing pretty good. There we go. Now getting some nice shots in. Just staying in there. Can it take down Achilles? I don't know, man. It's getting some nice shots in on Achilles right now, man. Maybe it can. Oh, that was a huge hit. And it does take that one. So that's one. All right. And it didn't lose any clicks that time. So two to one. Like I said, I'll just go to three. You know, makes sense. We're still two to one, man. Yo, nice shots by Dragon. Gonna break through. Oh, it got bursted, man. All right, so Dragon goes down. So that is four to one overall. I'm not gonna pause frame or anything. I'll just keep showing this off. But yeah. Also, I mean, this is obviously my Bakugan uh, mat. You guys can let me know if you'd want to see this for like backgrounds or anything, because like it looks really, really cool. Obviously. But, <laughs> but yeah. So now. <laughs> oh man, gotta love it. But yeah, now I'm gonna take it apart. And I'm going to switch this up. So I'm going to flip over the layer weight. You know, just flip it upside down. And it will make it, like I said before, like Hasbro slopes. Um, You know, and this obviously, like, snaps in easier. And then you just put this together. And, yeah, man. So here we go. Except it's, like, the more Hasbro version. And with honestly really tight slopes, dude. So, yeah. It's a pretty cool little accidental mod here. But let's see how it does. It obviously lost 4-1 to one in the first battle. So if it does better in this and even gets a burst, it shows like it might be stronger. Who knows? Let's see how it goes, man. Completely switched up. All right. Yo, that was a big hit. Okay. I wonder how Hasbro, like, when they make it. Oh, dude. All right. It got, it got bursted. But... It took three clicks away from Achilles, and the burst stopper is definitely what helped Achilles. So, definitely got to do another battle. So, that's two to zero. But you can see the impact for that was so, so strong, dude. That was crazy, man. It took a hit big time. It might even shift, like, the way it attacks and such. Like, yeah, look at it, dude. It gets more off balance because it's upside down. It changes up the balance. It ups its attack more. But, yeah, dude. Yeah, look at that. So it definitely has more attack, and it throws it more off balance. But look at, after all those hits, it barely lost, like, a little bit of slopes. <laughs> Just look at it. Look at it! Look at it! I, I had to get in there. You know, I had to. All right, here we go, man. Uh, staying in the center. But, yeah, it does throw it off balance, though. It ups its attack for sure. So doing this with something like uh, Slash Valkyrie would definitely be really crazy. But yeah, so that is uh, three. I'll just go one more, you know. Like, yeah. Oh, dude, look at those hits. Look at those hits, dude. Those hits were insane. Oh, but it got sent out. But it took the hits more. It really did. Let's see. Yeah, dude, it lost like half. Like half of those slopes, dude. So that's really crazy. Like just seeing a TT Bay acting like a Hasbro Bay, you know, with the slope system. But yeah, and as for Achilles, it uh, once again... It lost two clicks. It lost two clicks. And, you know, that means it was, like, 
doing a little bit better like click wise the only thing is is that it's balanced does get thrown off a little bit you know so maybe just having something like honestly maybe if i put something with more attack on it it might do like better you know what i'm i'm curious about this so for the sake of this video i'm gonna put i have an extra spiral um i'm gonna put spiral on it just to see how it would do if it just had like raw attack going around so let's, Wait, I just noticed something. let's see how this goes what what if you put the um, hex plate upside down and then put um, the power driver on it? Wouldn't that make it way more tighter? I just noticed that. Yeah, maybe. It pro it might. I don't know. It just, eh. it'll depend. Like, it depends on, like, when it gets launched right away, probably. But, yo, oh, that was a big hit. All right, so Achilles just shut that one right down. Dang, man. So it'll probably be better with something with, like, defense or such, like a defense driver. Like, maybe Orbit or something it might be better for it. But, yeah, you know. It is, it is really interesting though. You know, here we go. Now we'll really see. Yo, look at those hits. Yo, and it just sent it out. It got the KO. Wow. All right. And yeah, three clicks lost and not many slopes lost, dude. That's insane. Like, yeah, man, that's just, that's crazy. All right. One more battle. Ah, oh, man, I, I kind of launched that off a bit. But yeah, I'll do one final battle with this. Still, it like shows it for sure. Like, it, it definitely switches things up. And boom. Yo, oh my gosh, it's moving around like a quake, dude. That's crazy. It literally is moving around like a quake because it throws it off balance, man. It throws out because it's not supposed to be upside down, so it definitely throws out the balance of the bay. But it moves around like a jumping bean bay, you know? <laughs> so that's really crazy, man. All right, here we go. Boom. Throwing off the balance completely. Like, look at that, dude. Yo, even, like, barely spun. Like, look at those hits that it's getting. Yeah, definitely, like, the layer weight just being upside down is switching up everything. Like, look at that, dude. Just the way it moves. Those, oh, my gosh, dude. Wow. Oh, but it got bursted. But still, those hits. And this man's still recording while we still can't see. Those hits were insane, though, man. Yeah, yeah, I, I know. But, yeah, basically, like, you know, flipping it upside down will up the attack. So if you have something like Slash Valkyrie and you flip this upside down, then, like, it'll up the overall attack of Slash Valkyrie because it'll throw it off balance, you know. And maybe it'll make it where, like, um, you know, like, it'll up its attack, you know, like, throwing it off balance like that, which is really crazy. And also, like, the slope factor, too, because that switches up things a bit. But, yeah, overall, I'd say, yeah, it's about, it might be even stronger than, like, the slopes that Hasbro Bays have, believe it or not. Well, some of them, anyways. Like, they were actually pretty tight slopes. But, yeah, just returning it back to normal. Um, you know, it's good with the two teeth, obviously, because it's Valkyrie. But, yeah, man, anyways, that is the video on this kind of, like, you know, accidental mod, you know, that I found. But... Yeah, dude, this is really, really cool. It's really, really fun. Like, it's a really fun concept, and it can switch things up even more, you know, with, with GT. But, yeah, and maybe using this with, like, some layers down the road might be actually really interesting. You know, obviously, like, you're not legally allowed to do it, but, yeah, you know, <laughs> just, like, for fun and obviously, like, the mods and such. But, yeah, anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this epic Beyblade mod. If you did, be sure to slice that like button down below. Let me know how I did. If you're new to my channel, definitely be sure to subscribe for epic content because I upload daily. And if you haven't already, be sure to ring that bell by my channel name to be notified when I upload a video. So, yeah, guys, till next time, it is your boy Kimbo signing off. See you guys later. Thanks for watching. Till then, stay awesome. And cool shoot. I'm up out of here, man. I also gotta get Achilles. See you later, guys. Yeah. Bye. Happy birthday, Bye. Kizzle. Thanks. I don't even know. Bye, Kizzle. Bye.